Irina Kilenko. I am so excited to welcome you to my new dance program called the Sculpted Blossom. As one of the oldest civilizations, India has an incredibly rich and diverse tradition of artistic expression. In terms of movement, it has eight exquisite classical dance forms, as well as numerous other ancient and modern traditions that are thriving today. Unlike Western dance, the classical dances of India have roots that reach back hundreds, if not thousands of years. This project is a collection of combinations that were inspired by just a few foundational principles of one classical dance called Odissi. Arguably one of the most graceful and lyrical of all Indian classical dances, Odissi is essentially a series of beautifully sculpted poses and fluid and sensual transitions between them. It is a classical dance, and as such, it's highly structured and it's codified. The feet, adorned with bells, have extremely specific positions. The hands tell stories with beautiful gestures called mudras. The whole body sways while exploring dynamic diagonals, while the eyes communicate themes that are beyond restrictions of language and time. One can spend their entire life studying this incredible art form and barely scratch the surface. What I've done here is build on just a few basic steps and principles of movement that are commonly found in Odissi. I've taken many liberties and allowed my imagination to run wild. You will not be learning what would be considered a pure form of the classical dance. What you will learn are combinations and phrases that were inspired by my studies, originating from points where I could see a natural conversation happening between Odissi and belly dance. I play with some classical steps, but I choose to relax the form and I suggest some changes. I start us off with short and vigorous warm-up. I suggest you do your own stretches that tend to your special needs before starting the program. I will then proceed into a series of basic drills looking at head, eye, and ribcage movement that is foreign to belly dance. From there, we move on to hand and arm patterns, where we will explore several gestures called mudras. These short combinations will bring awareness to your wrists and fingertips. These are generally ignored in belly dance, but are full of grace and energy in Odissi. From there, we go over a few short footwork drills. The footwork in Indian classical dances is always intimately connected to the music and is the point from which the movement progresses upward through the body. So it will require strength, precision, and your focus. In the following sections, we incorporate elements of Odissi-inspired movement with belly dance through short dance combinations. I would like to mention that this video is not for beginners. It is aimed at intermediate to advanced level dancers who feel completely comfortable with belly dance technique. In this project, I do not break down belly dance steps. I expect you to be familiar with them. This program progresses at an enthusiastic pace. The combinations increase in difficulty and are ultimately combined into a full-length choreography. Closely interconnected, we will flow from the sculptural shapes into the more familiar belly dance steps, seeing how the two styles of dance talk to each other. The Sculpted Blossom requires a lot of self-discipline. For all combinations, there will be nuanced hand and footwork, as well as layers of head, eye, and torso articulation. It is up to you to add them all successfully. Most of this product was not designed as a follow-along instructional. I will give you what you need to understand the technique, but you will have to work on it independently. Allow yourself the time to enjoy each combination at your own pace. Work with them to your favorite music, or maybe insert them into your current repertoire. Finally, I remind you to be gentle with yourself. It is important to listen to your body and to progress at a pace that is comfortable for you. This program will truly involve your whole body from head to toe. Challenge your focus, your balance and strength as well as your ability to layer movements and carefully control the position of your eyes, fingers, arms, feet, and of course your hips. And if you find yourself curious about the traditional movements that inspired this work, I'll be putting a downloadable file on my website with additional resources. Odissi is an extremely difficult but elegant, sensual, and highly lyrical art form that teaches self-awareness and natural grace. I am so thrilled to share with you what this incredible art form has inspired in me. Happy Shimmies!